Mary Kay, what's the latest on the air quality? It's here? still in the very unhealthy category for Chicago, and now our friends in Detroit are right. matching us at that same level. My in-laws are there, and my husband's whole family, and wow, wow same view mm -hmm. that we have, mm -hmm. or lack thereof. <laughs> Trying to watch our cameras to get a vantage point as far as how is visibility doing. Well, it hasn't changed a whole lot. Winds are super light, 76 degrees. That's our current temperature right now. It's 74 at Midway, 70 in Valparaiso, 73 degrees in both Aurora and also Kankakee. Wildfire smoke forecast does show signs of hope, but not until tomorrow. So watch what happens tomorrow. We start moving winds out of the south, and that helps to clear the smoke, pushing it away from us. I think this change will happen around lunchtime or early afternoon tomorrow. So what you see is what you get until lunchtime tomorrow. Then we'll start to see some improvements. With that becomes a, also comes a pattern change. Tomorrow's rain chance is 50%, and we'll keep it on settled here as we reach into the weekend leading up to the July 4th holiday. So we have to turn the winds around from the south, but that also will bring in some instability. Few showers are possible today, but it's going to be very isolated in the activity. As we get into tomorrow, though, we'll watch a few waves of rain, one perhaps very early in the morning before sunrise and just after daybreak, then a break in the middle of the day. But we're turning up the temperature to almost 90. So late day storms are a possibility as we go through the rest of the afternoon and evening. So Storm Prediction Center keeping an eye out. Large hail, wind damage with the strongest cells. That's for tomorrow. Then we turn our attention to the big NASCAR event this weekend. Scattered storms, a 50-50 chance on Saturday. Then Sunday, we're hoping for clearing. Noticeably cooler downtown, too, for the race. 74 degrees in the loop instead of the 80s like we will see on Saturday. So for right now, Saturday has the higher chance of rain versus Sunday, but we will watch the timing of that as we move through. Then what we will see is everything kind of taper off for us and then we dry out early next week after we dry out Monday into Tuesday, then it gets hot all over again for us. We're going back to the upper 80s, almost near 90 degrees by the middle of next week as well. So July 4th, it looks like things will be getting hotter for us. So poor air quality still for us today. Tomorrow we see improvements with that, but we bring in that storm threat.